hi this is summer with summer's tips and stitches and this is a shopping haul as you can see on my cute sign um <clears throat> so i just had a fabulous weekend um my brother-in-law Ooh, i'm having a hair thing there there we go my brother-in-law for a christmas present for maddie his niece decided he wanted to take her out on a wonderful magical christmas present evening so he his um partner chelsea and then they let me go too because maddie's 11 so this was this was amazing and then maddie the three of us we had a girls night we went to appleton we stayed at the copper leaf spa we ate at a fancy restaurant down on college avenue and then we went to see this the phantom of the opera at the pac and they were amazing tickets, very great seats. Um, it was a really great time. So after doing that, um, since I was in Appleton, I was like, on the way home, I'm like, I have to go to Michael's. Because I don't enjoy driving other places, and I know many of you know that. And since I was already in Appleton, I thought, I better go to Michael's. Now, I didn't know if Michael's was already having some kind of sale or anything going on. Um, because I have my notifications for Michael turned off because I don't want to be sad that I can't go up there. So I didn't know what they would have. Um, coming into it, once I got back there, I saw that they had five. They had their regular Karen cakes for five, five ninety nine. dollars They had an end cap of latte cakes. And then in the back, in their clearance bin, they had cotton cakes for $4.97. So I snatched up some cotton cakes. I got, um, what is this one called? Lavender Fields. Ooh. And it kind of has like a creamy brown color, a creamy color, a green color, and a lavender color. I got two Lavender Fields. Now, Lavender Fields is not 100% cotton. It's a 60% cotton, 40% cotton mix. It has a rounded strand. Do you see that? I don't know if you can tell. It's more of a rounded strand of cotton, not as loose as like a um, peaches and cream or whatever. And there are, I'm trying to find out how many yards are in here. 530 yards. So I'm pretty excited about these. These were $4.97. And um, I got the I got two of these. This one's called Peach Blossom. Now they did have one solid color, which was more pinky than this is orange. Um, and unfortunately, this one has has some issues going on there. It looked good on this side, but that side's kind of a hot mess. So I just got four of those. I wanted more, but there was really no reason to go crazy. And I did buy a latte cake. Now, I'm not exactly thrilled about the latte cake because it is a fluffy yarn and I don't like these little strands, but I hadn't used one yet and so I thought I would get one. A latte cake is 58% acrylic, 42% nylon, 530 yards, and this sucker was $9.99. Isn't that beautiful? Um, this to me looks like an ocean horizon blue this was the only colorway that I really liked there because I really like to stay to pink blues and purples and um, so yeah look how pretty it is though. I'm gonna put it right there Ooh. okay so I got these four cotton cakes one latte cake and that is all I got for the cakes then the they had 50% off their loops and threads yarns. So I went through, um, since this is my favorite loops and threads colorway for Charisma, um, this one's called Northern Lights. I did buy two of them. I just used my last, um, last one of these on making those hats for my second graders. So I got two more of these and these were only four bucks. And then, I don't know if y'all remember this, a really long time ago, I bought this yarn, Barcelona Colorway Breeze. And these are regular price 
regular price $7.99. So with the 40% off or 50% off, these were four bucks. And I didn't realize that when I grabbed a couple because they didn't have the 50% tag by the Barcelonas. Um, so when I was at the register and they rang up 40%, I was like, Maddie, can you please go back and get me some more? Because I love this. Now, I will try my best to remember, friends, to link in the description a really long time ago, probably about a year ago, quite frankly, I made um, Mikey's Granny Shrug. Yes, that's what it is. With this, um, I actually first saw a purple version, which I think Rose Likes Crochet made with a purple Karen cake. I don't remember the colorway, but it's a bunch of different shades of purple. It was actually the very first video I ever saw of Rose Likes Crochet. And I was like, Where, what are you wearing? That's so cute. And she said it was Mikey's Granny Shrug. And so I went to his website, I watched the tutorial, and I made one of those with four of these. And then I also made a hat and a couple pairs of mittens. And I really love these. I love this colorway. Um, I just, so I now have five of them. Do I need any of them? No, I don't have any room. Why did I buy so many of them? I'm not sure. I'm thinking about just making a nice big throw blanket. Um, so yeah, that is my little mini. Now you can't even see my sign because of my yarn. That is my shopping haul. Now, I also bought my daughter two plastic dogs. Now, those of you who have kids, you know you end up doing this sometimes. You're like, why did I waste my money on that? In the kids section, they had like these like little dogs. They were $5 each. One was a Dalmatian and one is a pug. So I spent $10 on that. I bought Flynn this fossil because Flynn's going through a rock and gem phase. And he oftentimes looks outside in the rocks in our landscaping stones for fossils, which he'll never find one in there. So I got him a real fossil. This was $7.99, and this was at J Michael's. National Geographic box of fossils. This is a tri-lobite. So I bought him a fossil. And the reason I'm telling you this is because I wanted to tell you my grand total, but it wasn't with this yarn. So my grand total was $83. I spent 15, I bought Jared this big stuffed animal pug thing. So 83 minus 15 is 73 minus three is 70, 68. 68 minus eight is 60. Then I bought Maddie that, those stupid dogs for 10. So that's $50 is what I spent on yarn. Can you believe I spent all that crap, that money on kid stuff? And I bought, so $50 if it was yarn, and I got two Charismas, five Barcelonas, four cotton cakes, and a latte. So that's a super good deal, yo. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve skeins of yarn for 50 bucks. So I think that's super. Um, I spent almost as much buying junk for my kids as I did clearance yarn. But I mean that's what I mean that's what moms do, I guess. I don't know, maybe maybe good moms don't. Um <clears throat> I am giving Flinny the fossil for Christmas and I am giving Jared, you know those squishy pillows? They're like gushy squishy somethings. They look they're round balls and they have like a dog face on them and little ears. For some reason he wanted one. Jared did. And Jaren's moving into that preteen stage, and so sometimes I really want to squishy his baby still. So I got him that little dog thing. So, yeah, all in all, it was a really great trip to Michael's. Um, I really enjoyed it. I think $4 for this skein of yarn is a great deal. This is $328, 328 yards, 100% um, acrylic, but this stuff is so incredibly soft. I just love it. So I'm gonna hoard some of that for a while. But yeah, that's my Michael shopping haul. Now I, this is uh, December 14th. I'm gonna release this video probably um, a couple days later because I have a yarn chat that I'm gonna put up and that's from last week. Last week, like Wednesday, I think I filmed two or three videos. I did a crochet box, I did a swap box, and then I did a yarn chat. And so the yarn chat all come out 
before this, but this is being recorded on December 14th. Yeah, so that was my little mini shopping haul. I mean, it's not as much as sometimes, you know, you really would like to spend, but you have to draw the line because as you can see, my shelves are overflowing. Um, but I did want to make some, I did want to make a baby blanket with this or a throw. And I don't know what I'm going to make with this beautiful thing. Probably, I mean, probably a scarf is all you would want with that. I don't know. I'm going to have to look up online or maybe spam me with some cute things you guys have made with the Karen latte cake. How many yards is in this? 530. A latte cake. It's cute. All right. Well, that's all I have. I got to go upstairs. <coughs> And wrap some Christmas presents. Um, thanks for liking and subscribing. Thanks for watching and sharing my videos. And until the next video, happy crafting. Bye.